Did Neville Goddard teach you not to manifest a specific person, just to manifest love, to go general? Now, go general, darling, is a saying that law of attraction people say. I have never in my whole life heard a Neville Goddard lecture, and I've listened to every single one of them and read every single one of them, where he says the words go general. Sounds like you've got that from Abraham Hicks or some complete bullshit. What Neville Goddard himself did was manifest a very specific person. It was, in fact, his second wife whilst he was still married to his first wife. Now, they were separated for an awfully long time and he hadn't seen her for an awfully long time and she refused to give him a divorce and he still managed to manifest his very specific person who became his wife. And he slept every night as if she was in the other bed because they had separate beds in those days in New York as if she was living with him and they were blissfully, happily married. Now, anyone who turns around and says that Neville Goddard never told you to manifest a specific person forgets that very, very blatant fact that his second wife was completely manifested by him. And she also had been told that she would marry someone with the first initials N, Nev, right? So when she met him, she kind of felt like, oh, you're my person, okay? So they both manifested each other. Now, what Neville did talk about was this man or no man. And what he meant by that was a lot of people are very fixated on one person and they think that person is going to give them the love they crave. However, what he was talking about was if you feel loved, if you assume you are lovable, you will experience that love from either that person or another. He's not saying don't manifest the person you want. He's just saying the loveless make manifest their lovelessness is what he said. If you feel unlovable, it doesn't matter who you're trying to manifest. You're not going to manifest them because you essentially feel unlovable and loveless. Okay? But he's not saying don't manifest the person you want. He manifested the very, very specific wife that he wanted. But if you can get yourself into a state where you feel lovable and loved, sometimes, and this is what happened with some of his followers, they would want a very specific person and he would say, what if you found out that man was an axe murderer? Oh, I'd still want him. Would you? Oh, no, not really. So it's not this man or no man. You just want a man who gives you the love feelings that you want, right? That's what he was going on about. So he's not necessarily saying you can't manifest a specific person. He's saying what feelings, what state does the feeling of love put you in? You can also get that from another person, not just the specific person you want. Sometimes it doesn't end up being the specific person you want. I know that's happened to me. I know that's happened to a lot of people in my group where they came into my group, they started following me to manifest a specific person. Then when their self-concept improved and they leveled up and they put themselves on the pedestal and tore that other person down from the pedestal, they actually started looking down on them and thought, what do I even want this guy for? I want someone else. And then they manifest in their perfect person from their new, wonderful, confident, lovable self-concept. That's what he's talking about. He's not saying go general. He's not saying don't love the person you love. He's saying whatever state you're in will manifest whatever happens out here, including the person. And you can try and manifest a specific person all you like, but if you don't change you, if you don't assume you're lovable, if you are making manifest your lovelessness, then you'll still not be loved, regardless if it's them or someone else. So I don't want you to be listening to any creators who tell you that Neville Goddard told you not to manifest a specific person. That is such complete bullshit. There are so many creators who listen to Neville and don't hear him correctly, who don't comprehend what he's saying. He never said that, okay? <laughs> he never said go general. So I don't know where you got that from, but just throw that away and understand you can manifest whoever you like, but it's coming from you. What state are you in? That will make manifest your lovelessness or the love you want, okay? If you don't get this, get my Worthy AF for Love course or get back and begging when it drops this Monday in the squad. It's my Manifest Your Specific Person back course. And if you're after a specific person, darling, I teach you in there how you don't have to go general. You can get the one you want, okay?